know, the world in the 21st century faces so many problems which are complicated. But complicated because they involve the whole world. Globalization means that the issues are interdependent with each other, across borders. So it's a huge enterprise to say, how do you deal with that? How do you bring together and bring forward new ideas that have both the depth to deal with the technical issues and the breadth to deal with all the linkages across the world? The World Economic Forum had thought, right, what we need is global redesign. We need to rethink the way the whole world is organized. There's about 80 Global Agenda Councils. Each one has its own issue and brings together about 15 experts drawn from companies, governments, academia. The Global Agenda Council is a fascinating collection of people, really bright minds. The world's smartest thinkers and experts from around the world, from different regions, different stakeholder groups. And they get together, first by telephone, teleconference, then they come together once a year at the summit When we come together as a summit, we can grab experts from other parts of the world, from other groups, and really get a better sense of the issue. The thing is, you can't solve all problems at once, and nor can you apply one solution to them all. But as you try to solve each set of problems, you've got to recognise and understand what those other circles look like and how they touch on the issues that you're trying to deal with. Is that interplay between one council and the other on problems which are across the boundaries of the council that is fascinating and very important. But one of the things that makes this work as a brainstorming exercise is that every Agenda Council finds its own way of working and every one of them is actually producing a very different kind of output. Some are producing programs for activism, some are producing very intellectual ideas with footnotes. Each is coming up with a new way of coming at the problem, but they're very different and non-prescriptive. It's really that they're an incubator for the kinds of ideas and debates that global leaders discuss at Davos. We might see this week some sort of template emerge. There are expectations. Good to see you. Welcome back to, uh, to our position. Here.